So I'm here today with Chung Chi Leong, who is the CEO of Chagamas Berhad. For a national mortgage, mortgage agency, you are relatively unusual in that you have a large amount of private sector ownership. How does this influence your approach to your objectives? Since 1986, when Chagamas was established, this was actually to be a private public partnership between the central banks and the financial institutions that exist in Malaysia at that time. I guess this partnership really augurs well for the organisation because it saw substantial and significant growth in the Chagamas business from the early years until today. The um, company is run basically by a professional management team which is oversight from the board of directors comprising of independent board of directors who are not uh, operating or uh, presently, senior management of financial institutions. So basically, uh, the Chagamas is run very independent of the shareholders. Your purchase with recourse program has some similarities with covered bonds. Given the expansion of covered bonds in Asia, in countries like Singapore and most recently Japan, do you think there is a role for a more traditional covered bond market in Malaysia? Firstly, I guess when you talk about the comparison between purchase with recourse and covered bonds, it is the dual recourse that you're talking about. Basically, there's a recourse to the asset pool as well as to the obligor, which is the institution's concern. Now, as far as the covered bond is uh, development in Malaysia, we actually see that the regulators are currently looking at some form of regulatory guidelines, but at this present moment, there is no regulatory guidelines uh, being prescribed for covered bonds. Covered bonds could still be issued using the current regulatory framework. Now, given that scenario, you may see that investors may not find it attractive basically to invest in covered bonds given that it is much more expensive compared to a normal uh, bond. As an issuer, for example, for Chagamas, we are rated AAA. And as such, we do see that uh, there would be some cost savings in terms of our issuance, uh, in terms of the yield. However, the overall cost would be probably more expensive given the uh, need to have a rating, for example, and also to have an additional covered pool. In the international arena, basically Chagama C as a very uh, attractive uh, proposition to look at covered bonds. Given that we are rated A3, same as the Malaysian sovereign rating. Now, having said that, obviously we will need to see how far we can pierce that rating, how far we can get uh, a rating uplifted, in order to actually enjoy the facilities of the uh, what you call this um, repo facilities of the European Central Bank. If we can actually pierce those ratings, similar to uh, what you call in countries like uh, Singapore and Korea, perhaps that would be a good time for us to actually look at issuance covered bonds in the foreign currency space. Affordable housing is a global issue now. Being a mortgage company to promote home ownership, how does Chagamas see itself as a bridge between the capital markets and a critical issue, issue such as affordable housing? Well, Chagamas has been involved in the affordable housing sector. In fact, um, through all these years, we have been involved in providing liquidity to financial institutions by tapping the capital market or the fixed income market to allow banks to be able to lend on the longer tenor to the end house buyers. The affordable housing uh, issue is really something close to our heart. In fact, in the last number of years, Chagamas has been involved in a mortgage guarantee business which allow us to facilitate and help first-time house buyer to own their first home. I think over the last number of years, we have at least helped about 20,000 uh, individuals as well as household to own their first home. Moving forward, Chagamas is looking at various um, innovative schemes to actually facilitate first-time house buyers and also to help the government fulfill its mandate to provide affordable housing to the general public. So for example, we are looking at how we can help in terms of funding some of these rent-to-own schemes or rental housing schemes 
of even the shared equity schemes, which will provide avenues and opportunities to first-time house buyers.